When it comes to a, a woman divorcing a man or leaving a man, it's for two reasons. Maybe that man got on one knee and gave a ring to the wrong woman, meaning that she got suffering from too much trauma and you got with the wrong woman and it can't nothing satisfy her. She is, she's, you know, for the streets. Or the other reason is, well, my dog, maybe you're a little bit too feminine and your woman was taking charge and women can't respect the man that, that, that she's looking down at. She can only respect the man that she admires, meaning looking up to. Hello, welcome to Reactions and Reviews. I'm your humble host, Eze. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy the show. Shout out to this brother, the creator of No Forgazy Podcast. And I appreciate our good brother, Eric D. Dunn, for sending this clip. After I watched this, I was intrigued. So what I did was, I went to his channel and I looked at more videos. He does good content, okay? And I will be reacting to more of his videos. However, we are gonna focus on this video right here. And what he says is perfect. Like I always say on this channel, always on this channel, Women tend to pick the wrong man, right? They go after the man they know for a fact that is not right for them. And when it doesn't work out, what do they do? They not lump all men into that category. Men are dogs. Men are no good. Men are this, men are that. Or men are feminine. Men are not men anymore. Men are weak. Men are this. Do you understand what I'm saying? And today is going to be a perfect lesson of why that is. You know, a lot of women, no, scratch that. Majority of American women, that word submissive is a trigger. It's a trigger for them. They hate that word submissive. As soon as you tell a woman, yo, you need to be submissive to your man. That woman feels like you cussed her out. It's like you cussed her out. And in today's episode, we are going to take a look at how this brother broke down this sister right here, which is, you know, just by her words. You can tell she's a part of the sisterhood. She's a rebel. She's a mother woman. Okay, let's get to it. So those are the two reasons. And when women and she's agreeing that when women divorce men, it falls into, the one, of into those one of those two reasons. And usually it falls into the man inadequate, not having the ability to properly lead that woman. Because in most situations, a masculine man can lead a woman that's been through some trauma and all of that. Well, you know, I, for me, a, a man's not going to lead me, period. So I, I'm yeah. going to we're going to we're going to be partners. <laughs> okay. and we, I'm we, speaking we, in general. Yeah. Well, so for me, it doesn't it, it, it doesn't um, it's not it doesn't um, qualify. And this is exactly why brothers are running away from sisters. This is exactly why. Did you hear what she said? For you, 19% of women that watch my content, my whole channel is based on those words she just said. That is why men, especially black men, because I'm a black man, that is why black men are no longer protecting black women. That's why black men are no longer providing for black women. That is why black men are no longer proposing to black women. That is why black men are no longer approaching black women. And that is why a lot of brothers are going overseas because of these words she just said. The bottom line, she is stubborn. She is stubborn. She's a hair raiser, meaning she's not going to listen to no man. I don't care what you say or what you do. She will not listen to you because she sees you as equal. She doesn't see you as a leader. She does not see any man as a leader. Therefore, she will not listen. She will buck the system consistently. No man that took 20 years, 30 years to build himself up will touch or marry this sister. She's cute. Some will hit, smash, and keep it moving. But nobody will take her serious. Why? Because of her mentality. These, those words she just said. It's going to keep her single. My dear sisters, do not think, operate, and talk like this sister. You will end up alone. Let's keep going. If you made it this far, hit that like button and leave a comment to trigger YouTube's algorithm. I'm a new channel and I'm trying to grow. So hit that subscribe button and hit that bell to let you know every time I upload a new video. 
Well, I definitely don't want a, a feminine man. Like, that is not attractive to me. Okay, so but one also, of the traits... But I also, okay, go ahead. I also don't want a man that's trying to... Um, control Dominate, you. control, tell me what to, to do. Dominate in not, what way? Not... not um, um, uh, listen to my opinion or my thoughts or consider what I have to say. I want somebody who's going to be a partner. And then, of course, there will be times where a man will lead in a certain area that maybe he's best at. Yeah, but the word for, partner. And then, and then I will do the same. So if if there's a decision to be made about something, let's assume that I'm married or in a relationship, we will make the decision together. He will, I will listen to what he says. He's gonna listen to what I say, and then the, someone has the, to be the final decision maker. Is it gonna be you or the man? It just depends on whoever is better at that thing at that moment. But I, but and, and generally speaking, in most situations, who do you think would be making well, decisions? You're gonna say it's a man, but I. But what do you think? That. You think that it'd be equal? No, I, yeah, I think it depends on what what the situation. Okay, got is. You, but this is what I'm saying with your thinking you actually disqualify yourself from meeting masculine men because just you using words I mean, like partnership thank you thank you what is so hard for women to understand you can't have two captains you understand what I'm saying when you get on an Amtrak train going from let's say Atlanta to LA there's only one captain of that train that's only whatever they're called I don't know if they're captain or driver whatever they're called there's only one when you're driving in your car, you can't have two people trying to drive. Y'all will literally wreck the car. The same thing with plane. That's why that's one captain flying the plane. Now, that captain has, you know, a crew, someone that's doing the navigation. The same thing in a car. If you're driving in a car and someone to give you direction, cool. Or someone is telling you, hey, you're going too fast, slow down a little bit. The speed limit is 75, you're doing 90. See, all that is cool. That's navigating. Nothing is wrong with that. And that's what she was talking about. I want to, I want to talk. I want a man to a partner, blah, 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 blah. Listen, no man, ladies, understand this and understand this. No man on this planet wants a woman that can run over or walk over. It, it, it's a turn off. Every man wants a woman with a backbone. Backbone, not challenging. Not being rebellious, not being disrespectful, meaning you have your own opinion, meaning you have your own views. A lot of men find that attractive. That's how couples do. At the end of the day, it is up to the man what needs to be done in that house. But for some reason, you modern women, this sisterhood, y'all want a man to drive, but y'all also want to drive. That, it, 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 it's, it's not going to work. It is not going to work. Now, what do you guys think? Do you agree or do you disagree? Either way, leave your comments below so we can start this conversation. Until the next video, stay safe in the streets. Later. That will wrap it up for today's episode. And thank you for joining me. So please, leave a comment uh, below. If you agree, if you disagree, it doesn't matter. Leave the comment below. And also, you tell me what you want me to cover. You tell me what you want me to discuss and what you want me to react to. Okay? And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for joining me. And I'll see you on the next episode. Please don't forget to subscribe. Let's rebuild the Black Nuclear Family. It is needed. Okay? God bless.